Hey guys, it's Beer now, and we got our part to do. We got our 30 minutes of non-stop Mario action. Don 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 don. I don't think there's any music for non-stop Mario action. I guess just a Mario remix. Maybe Dance Dance Revolution, all that fun stuff. Anyway, we're gonna be heading to Freeze Flame because I'm gonna be getting that secret star, no matter how long it takes me. Because I completely remembered where it was. Completely. First of all, you gotta go to the frozen peak of Baron Burr. Just skip. You gotta talk to this penguin. Penguin, as some people say. As some people, as referred to by no one. Got him. Trick is to jump. Not bad, old man. You have a chance of being a grand champion. Anyway, off we go to Frozen Mountain Land. Do you love Frozen Mountain Land? Frozen Mountain Land is pretty cool. Alright, so firstly what we gotta do is we gotta skate over, I sequence broke it, well that wasn't sequence breaking, that was intentional. They place a tricky but nice shortcut there. But in order to do this you gotta get that. Jump across a few of these. And long jump. Let's get that ice flower, now you're gonna wanna come over here, pull a nice triple jump, and then another nice triple jump. To get up here, and then you gotta get that ice flower, because apparently now we're using that's not an ice flower, that's a fire flower. Jeez. Anyway, you can ignore that one, but you're gonna need to destroy this one just by just by aiming forward and using the fireballs provided. Oh, that was close. <laughs> you can always go back, but for time's sake, it's a lot better if you do it first go, you know? Dang, rocks are in the way. I just jump over that, can't I? Yeah, that's the thing. With these flowers, you can't spin. And I'd like to spin, because then I don't have to take out the... Snowman behind me. You just go up here. Oh, anyway, you can't kill these bats. The bats will freeze you like that. But they get kind of annoying. Alright. That's a tricky rock. There you go. And we're almost there. Just a bit of a tricky platforming section with a block! Wondering how do you do this? Well, just wait for them to proceed back in and then jump up a few times, and there you go! Triple jump to the star! Yeah! That is probably the worst hidden star. Or it's one of the worst. Just because it's so out of its way and it does so, so much different stuff. It's not just kind of, oh, it's just hiding behind something. It's like a whole different stage, pretty much. Which is cool in its own way, you know? Now I'm gonna have to be there. I'm gonna have to drain a bit of this part's time because I'm gonna be heading off to Justy Dusty June's other hidden star. Wait, what? So 
Sunbaked Sand Castle? Stuff that. I completely forgot what I was doing. Anyway, we'll head off to Bowser. I, saw, I, I just did a hidden star. Why is there another one? I completely forgot. I swear only Battle Rock had seven stars, but maybe this one does too. Oh, that's kind of strange. Anyway, this is Bowser's Dark Matter Plant. Those goo effects are pretty awesome. That being said, you don't want to experience them firsthand. Anyway. Ah, oh, Dude, I was totally going to jump on that. Not on the awesome purple sludge. You can kind of see the effect they're going with. I just got a texture in the background. But it's so well done just because it looks really thick and all that stuff. Okay, gravity switching. Oh, shenanigans. You want to make sure you're on the correct side of things. Also, remember that you're pushing in the direction that Mario is going in relation to the screen. For example, I'm pushing up to actually go up here, but now I'm pushing left. You could probably backflip your way onto that. And if there was green stars, they'd totally put one there. And then I like this, the, um, the anti-matter, because seriously, I don't know many games that have anti-matter. And anti-matter is pretty awesome. Bring along it! Oh, yeah! Whoa, goodness! <laughs> that was extremely close for my liking. There you go. Up we go. Whoop, now we're on the ceiling. Ah. <laughs> and the music is still awesome because it's the same music. It's awesome because it's the same one. And I like this, you know, trying to keep on to the bit where gravity is going, although it's a fair bit slow. But you gotta make sure you don't panic. Don't don't overshoot that. Because Mario does take a bit of a dive, it goes across. And then, you're gonna need to jump up, and then you gotta get over here. Because then he'll go on this side. And again, you don't wanna jump too high now, because otherwise you'll touch the sludge. You don't wanna touch the sludge. Sludge isn't good for your health. And then, boom. Jump that guy. Now, whoa. Oh, that's not. It's not flipping gravity, it's all good. I wonder what the Luma is gonna talk about. Aw, oh, dang it! The Luma has magical stair building abilities. Dang it, I thought I didn't have to save them. And we made it! To Mr. Bowser Man! Why, Joel? That's it, Mario! I'm gonna stomp you into space bits! Oh. Oh, goodness. Okay, so basically the Bowser fight is quite similar to it to the one before. Yeah, uh, he's just got a few more attacks, but other than that. You also want to watch out for the thingos on the... for the bit sticking out, because they'll kind of get in your way. <laughs> yeah. Good old Bowser. Oh, it's also got fireballs, and these fireballs will survive for a while when they go around the planet. You want to make sure you don't get hit by them when they go on their recourse. So there's two spins and eight jumps. There you go. But of course, it's Nintendo logic. Every boss takes three hits! Makes sense actually, because Mario takes three hits. I don't like Mario. Oh goodness. There you go, got him. Oh, he goes at an angle. It's not supposed to go at an angle! I think I botched that up. 
Yep, I got it. It's not supposed to go at an angle. Oh. There you go. That wasn't so bad, wasn't it? Oh, I fell on my noggin. Oh, it's getting rather dark. Oh, not bad. I guess I chose the right guy to be my arch enemy. I lose you always put up a fight, but it's too bad for you because my master is over the top of And he vanished. But that planet had a grand star, just submerged in lava with the regenerating bits of blue glass. Blue glass. This t calls for a. Yeah. So anyway, that was all good. Ten minutes in, we got Grand Star. It'd be very good if I got the um, Hungry Luma as well. I might, I might knock off the Hungry Luma. So anyway, one thing that I was noting was that they said, um, last part that uh, that in order to um, to make things epic and stuff. They're going to be doing the Bowser, the last Bowser mission off screen, probably between parts. And I'm like, you know, that's a good idea. Maybe I should end this part with, maybe I should do all the Bowser missions. I should do all the Bowser missions. Anyway, so we got everything in the engine. Is that the engine or is that the something else? So yeah, I was going, you know, I've got... I need three more stars, and I've got two more Bowser galaxies to go. So basically, I was like, okay, do that Hungry Luma, then do the two Bowser galaxies, and then I can do the final one off screen, and then I've got stuff. Because in order to beat the game, or in order to get all 120 stars, you need to beat Bow the final form of Bowser, the final Bowser stage. Actually, what am I saying? There isn't a Bowser stage at the end. Why am I going into the bedroom? You know, in the bedroom! No, no, I don't need to go in the bedroom. I need to go to in the Hungry Luma. Because I've got enough for Hungry Luma. It's 800, isn't it? I need 800! So yeah, but you need to beat the final form of Bowser in order to get the... Oh, I need to do two stars, dang it. See if I... That heart, hidden star, but anyway beat the final form of Bowser and you activate the purple coin galaxies and they're trying to make it epic by ending on Bowser so for the most part if I manage to beat both Bowsers next part I'll be a star ahead in the gameplay the counter on the screen on the side will always show what's will, will, will be one less than what's going on on screen just because I've been Bowser. So anyway, this one's pretty fun. You need the golden shell. Why am I spinning? You need the golden shell in order to um in order to open the chest at the beginning. Now where the heck is that shell? Well you gotta go through all this. Just a bit of star bit collecting. Problem is, it's a scary big mouth galaxy. The only, the other thing is there also these star bits. Star, have I been saying star bits? These star chips, kind of. Watch out for the jellyfish thing, I was. They kind of uh, hide themselves in this kelp. And I swear I heard this music in Rayman too. There you go, there it is. It's not too tough. You know, they're just kind of hiding around there. And then they put a sling star! Underwater sling star, also watch out for those. I don't know whether the music actually got intense just for that. And then you hop out, and then, oh, there's water on the other side. There's also a, a fair amount of star bits surrounding the place. But yeah. Anyway, you're gonna want that, and then you're gonna want to be awesome, and just kind of jump down. So yeah, watch out for those torpedo thingos. Anyway, then you just need to find where you en enter the place. I have been looking in the wrong place, haven't I? Yeah, there you are. 
Also, don't drown. It's not good for your health. Oh, you can also get quite a few coins from the booze, but again, coins are quite irrelevant in this game. You just use them as health. It's a very nice idea for a galaxy, isn't it? And boom. Headshot. Oh gosh, it's a toad. Wow! That was close, Mario! Da 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 da! Da 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 da! Ba 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 ba! Da 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 da! Da 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 da! Take this power saw. Dun da 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 da! Okay. And anyway, we're back outside, which is good, because then I can head on to the engine! I, I just remembered that there is no Bowser uh, at the end of the six stone. Technically, you could say it's the final stage, but, but you need 60 stars in order to get there, so I need to do one more. One more star, which I'll be doing in the engine. I have no clue how to get to the engine. The engine is above, so i got to go this way. Gotta go this way, this way, this way, this way, Sonic X. Gotta be fancy, I'm gonna jump up like that. Ooh, what now? See, so yeah, I'm not gonna get... I'm probably gonna say, you know, six stars. I'm probably gonna be like, yeah, I'm gonna get six stars and that's it. We have discovered an enemy base in the region. I'll finish off with that, and then I'll... Okay, so firstly, I'm gonna do the side galaxy. The Bonefin Galaxy, yeah. Kingfin's Fearsome Waters. Da da da! Da da! Anyway, <laughs> anyway, this one kind of reminds me of the other one, of that one where you had to defeat the eels. I can't remember what it was. Oh no, it's still Rayman 2, the in the mouth camera. It sounds like Boulder Guys, but it's really just a fish. You probably could say it's boat fin. Guess how you beat it. By the way, in order to unlock the state. You need to actually defeat. You you need to get that star from before. Oh no! Now he's got torpedo heads. Or whatever they are. And I shouldn't die. Dying isn't good for my health. I'm gonna grab a coin. There'd be a coin in one of these chests, wouldn't there? Throw one up. Don't need one of those. Ooh, a red shell. Red shell! Red shell! That hit. I am so happy. The question is, where, where am I going to find a um, shell? There's a shell. There's a life shroom. Nah, I'll just go for a final hit. That was the final hit, right? Serious? Quick! Life shroom! Life shroom! Life shroom! Uh, uh, uh. Oh, thank goodness! Thank goodness I got the life shroom. Oh, gosh. Okay, back we go. Let's get that. Let's get that fish. Oh, you don't like mist. That, that shell's just gonna keep going. Where's it going? Oh, there you go. Red shell? Are you kidding me? You missed red shell. Oh, yeah, you gotta catch him. Are you kidding me? That's still not hitting. I swear, I've, I I, don't think I ever had pretty much any trouble on this guy before. He's going, he's going that way. Boom! What? Where's the shell? Where's the shell? 
I'll come around this way. For oh, goodness sake, get over here! Die! Still alive, wow. Alright, I'm gonna need to get him again. Oh, let's make it a turn. Let's make it a turn, this is my chance to hit you in the face. Still, no, he's dead. Okay. Five hits! What is it, Nintendo? What are you doing? Five hits, that's not. That's not what you do. Obviously not. This is most unorthodox. And now I gotta figure out where the star is. Give me that shell, and I'm gonna listen out for it. There it is. Dun da 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 da. So anyway, I got nine and a half minutes. I've only got four stars, but I'm like, you know, that's okay. I'll f I'll get one more star, and then I'll grab Bowser or Bowser Jr. actually, and then I'll get that. And then I'll finish the game off screen, because I did all 60 stars then. Or 61, actually. You know, beating Bowser, you require half the stars in the game, but you, you can't access a lot of them. So anyway, we'll get the first star in this galaxy. The Gold Leaf Galaxy. Wahoo! Da 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 so anyway, Star Bunny's on the hunt. I don't trust my Star Bunny catching. But anyway, this galaxy may look a little bit familiar. Oh, thank you. Thank you, TV. I really need you to do that again. Well, I need you to give me some objective. I'm looking for blue star chips. Alright. Well. Ah, oh, I'm not gonna get hit and fall off the edge again. No, sir. Okay, so I'm guess I'm just gonna be looking for blue star ships. There's one right here. Why did I think that would work? Anyway, uh, I'm guessing there would be a sling star here normally. Let's see if we can do it without getting the sling star. Yes. <laughs> Take that. Um, what's over there? There's water. Anyway, how long have we got left? Seven and a half minutes. Doing pretty awesome. Anyway, <laughs> and then there's a bee, and then there's Octorox over there. There's probably nothing up here. I definitely would think there'd be something behind the flower. Do I have to grab on that? No, but I greatly appreciate that. Or do I have to kill this guy? Oh, no, it's just past him. That's all I missed. There you go. I'm betting you the other one's behind this huge tree. Long. Stop making fourth wall jokes. Okay. Or references. Stop making fourth wall references. Where's that last star chip? Again, I greatly appreciate that, but... Oh, how could you not grab onto that? Unless if there honestly is one there. I bet you that there will be stars. Or coins. Again! Where the heck is it? I've literally searched everywhere now. Unless if it's like around the back. Well, there's an L. That's something for loading. My goodness. We're doing one of these again. The I walk around clueless. 
pot. Oh gosh, I just remembered. I can't swim. Alright. Leap of faith. I don't care I'm gonna get wet. I don't I don't care I'm gonna get wet. There's one up. Thank you. I really needed one. You think there would be a star chip around the back? In there. Yeah, you would. What are you gonna say? The bunnies. No, I hate bunnies. And I hate you too. Ah, gosh. Goodness. I, I seriously have no clue where the, um... Star chips are. Where the... Do I have to kill? No, I don't have to kill Wiggler. Wiggler would do nothing. I just remember that I, 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 I just saw that I could fly up to this ledge. It'd be up on this ledge. It'd be up on this ledge. Cause I'm a bee. There's a pipe. Does that have anything to do with anything? Ah, oh, there it is. Well, it is up on this ledge. Now I gotta go all the way back over there. My reward. Goodness! Oh, that's kind of cool. How those things don't replenish your fly. That sounds kind of wrong. Think you can catch me, boing oing? Maybe. If I wasn't a bee. That's not water. I was gonna hit him with the thingo. Maybe this would help. That would help. Oh, come on. I had him literally there. Wow, that was a great jump. You know what, I'm, I'm going to be grabbing that last star, uh, whether you like it or not. <laughs> that was a very good jump at the end there. Jeez. There's a star. Star over here. It's on the other side. Dang it, Steve. Dun, da, 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 rather dark, isn't it? Inside. But don't turn it on, it'll mess up my lighting. My perfect lighting. Wait, oh, I'm outside because now I can access freaking Bowser. Pesky Bowser. I'm going to take on Bowser Jr. because I know Bowser Jr. won't take too long. Yes, I know! Huzzah! No, I don't! I don't want to go to the center of the galaxy. That'll be for next... That'll be for next mid part. Alright. I'm taking on Bowser Jr. whether you like it or not. Cause only six stars, but you know, two Bowsers. Bowser Jr.'s lava reactor. This involves lava. Could you tell? Yeah, that's pretty cool how Yeah, plus the boss. Yeah, it's a short galaxy. It's just one planet and then the boss. Um a reused boss of that, but variation. It's not reused. Like, you know. Yes. It's kind of weird how King Caliente is reused before anyone else. 
Alright, so what is this? You have to get the bullet bills and don't fall in. You have to get a bullet bill to go over there. And how do you do that? Good question. Step one. Don't stand there. Alright. Fire! 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 Or else the buzzer's gonna ring. Oh, where's it gone? It's over there! Yes! So I know buzzers went off, but I'm just up to the boss. May as well just drag it on a bit. We actually, no, we got. We got. Quick, introduce the element. The element involves sinking platforms. I'm not gonna go for that sinking feeling pun, you know? You just say that sinking feeling. The tip is to constantly jump. While, you know, it, it is a bit hard to control if you constantly jump. The best tactic is just to switch between platforms, but if you need to stay on one platform, then just jumping is good. The other thing is that for some odd reason it's not sinking here. Ha! If I give up any more grand stars, my dad's gonna get mad, so that's why there's two left in the game. And I'm gonna give it to you at the end of this boss. Can you beat boss man? Boss man. It's King Caliente with red eyes. And he counts as a different boss. So we gotta do so basically he's all he is is basically he Oh for goodness sake. As a boss, all he does is that he starts from the second phase. So yeah. And anyway, so yeah. Um. So yeah, you, you gotta anticipate that. The other thing is that also those things are gonna get more annoying because you're kind of restricted on land space. Because you can't stay on one platform. But yeah, they're kind of still now. Oh, goodness. And then there's meteors. Oh, for goodness sake. That live stream came in handy, I guess. Other than that, though, the second hit, he still only takes three hits, and otherwise, then he's still pretty easy for a boss. For boss time! And then he gives you a grand star. Is it on the side that I am on? Close. So yeah, that's why I wanted to do this one, because this one's rather short. Da 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 See, that's kind of weird. You don't need all the grand stars in order to actually fight Bowser. To, to beat the game. You only you can skip on that one because there's enough stars to to get before you get to that. But anyway, I guess that that'll clear off. That's that's my whole part, pretty much. And you also unlock the garden, and there's a comet. So yeah, off screen I will be beating Bowser. Yeah. So this counter, it will not it'll be 62 next part. Just pay attention to the one on the right. Okay? Other than that, I'll see you kids next time. Woo! Backflip. Backflip. Why aren't you backflipping?